Joining us to discuss development with the COVID-19 pandemic is Ronke Posh. Thank you very much for joining us. Good morning. Looking at what's happening, all the latest development, do you think the easing of the lockdown has been productive? Um, from the number of cases that are rising, um, it's clearly not working. What are your observations on the use of the face mask and the level of compliance? Um, I had to go out for a interview uh, a few days ago, and I noticed around the banks that there were lots of people around there. Some were wearing the masks, and some were not wearing the masks. People were touching the masks, so people don't know how to use the mask. When they want to laugh, they remove the masks. So the compliance is not, it's not even near 50% from what I observed. People don't know how to use the mask. They wear it as they see, as they see fit. And are people washing these masks? So there are kind of like a lot of issues um, concerning the wearing of the masks that, um, that has been mandated on, on, on the state. Okay, uh, looking at um, everything that's been going on since the lockdown was relaxed, are you um, with the school of thought that says it should be reimposed, or do you think that is not the way to go? I think it's, it's, it should be reimposed, um, except for those essential services. Um, I've received notification from some service providers that I know can clearly still work from home. Say, for example, internet service providers saying that um, their offices are open at this time. So I do not believe that everybody needs to be in the office yet. Um, I have a lot of concern about the market, marketplaces as well, um, because they, they seem to be very congested from what I see on social media. Um, it's very congested. So to a significant extent, we still need that lockdown. I know that a lot of people are still hungry. A lot of people need food and a lot of people need to go out. But as much as we can, we really need to keep people at home as best as we can. A lot of monies have been donated in efforts to combat the spread of the virus. How would you access the level of transparency and um, um, utilization as regards uh, the management of the fund? Um, with regards to the management of the funds, I do not think it's transparent enough. I've not seen, um, I'm not, I don't know where to go probably, but I've not seen anything online. As a matter of fact, I saw a, a, um, a, a clip on social media where money was being shared in cash, and I wondered what happened to people's account numbers. So I do not believe that it is, um, there's a lot of transparency around the money that is being, um, that is being allocated. And I personally don't know anybody that has received anything. Thank you very much for joining us on the news. Thank you so much.